Gilbert. Let's just take care of a little business, then we'll get to our game. Hello, folks. It's Jeffrey G3 channel. I'm about to play my ninth game of Jeopardy for the second edition. Jeopardy second edition for the PC. I currently have an eight game winnings total of $120,800. Let's see if I can add to the total. Let's see my run for this game. Hi, I'm Johnny. Hello, folks. It's Jeffrey G3 turning up here about to do my sixth game play of Jeopardy second edition for the PC. Normal game. Okay. So, how many people out there? Seven hundred ninety-nine dollars. Player one, what's your name? Jeff, for your quest. Player one, here's your buzz in. Let's get this show on the road. From the Sony Pictures Studios, this is Jeopardy. Here he is, the host of Jeopardy, Alex Trebek. Thanks, Johnny. Welcome to Jeopardy. Have fun, and good luck to all of you. First round categories are as follows. What are the first one categories? Tribes. Okay. Now tribes, tribes. Now the first lines. Festive, Festive food. Myths, Myths and legends. TV, TV and, and film. And let's Finally. Final you do, you the do the math. math. Okay, this one, that one I would love. Let's get things underway. Player one. All right, Alex. Let's do. You do the math. Four hundred. Number of nursery rhyme blackbirds baked in a pie divided by number of nursery rhyme blind mice. Not too sure, but I know blind mice is three. Anyone? Blackbirds baked in a pie. I don't. I'm not sure about that part. Eight. For. So it's twenty-four divided by three. Okay. Do the math, two hundred. Number of ounces in a standard Averdupois pound divided by number of cups in a gallon. What is one? Yes. Yes. Sixteen divided by sixteen is one. You do the math, 300. It's the square root of the square root of 81. What is 3? Absolutely. Because 81, Again. square root of 9 is, 81 is 9, and square root of 9 is 3. Total number of U.S. Senators times the number of amendments in the Bill of Rights. Anybody? I'm not too sure about this one. The thousand. Here's the right response. You do math for 500. It's the number you get when you raise 10 to the fifth power. Player one. 10 times 10 times 10 times 10 times 10. It's 10,000. It's 100, then 1,000, then 10,000. It's 100,000. You're in fine yes. form, so pick again. Uh, let's do festive 400. How Louise suggest dyeing your kids' pancakes this color on St. Patrick's Day? What is green? Player one. Oh no, I spelled the wrong. But it gave it to me anyway. Again. Festive for 200. You can make pudding as well as pie from the pulp of this jack o' lantern plant. What is a pumpkin? That's right, pick again. Yes. Festive for 300. Cheese creplac and cheese blintzes are suggested dishes for Shavuot, a holiday of this religion. I'm not too sure about this one. I want to say Jewish. Player three. What is Judaism? Oh, Judaism, okay. I like TV and film. TV and film, 400. 100, Alex. It's the hip 1996 film that popularized lines like, Your money. I'm not sure about this one. Player three. What is swingers? Swingers. Definitely. TV and film. TV and film, 200. 200, Alex. The man seen here directed this 1941 cinematic masterpiece. If you'll just watch this. We'll show you the clue. I have no idea who that is. Player three. Player three. What is Citizen Kane? Exactly. Citizen Kane, okay. TV and film. Tier 4, 300. In 1998, this MASH star made a smashing return to Broadway in the hit play, Art. I'm not sure about this one. Player two? Who is Alan Alda? Alan Alda. That's correct. Okay. Play to the board now. Novels first, novels first lines, lines for 100. 400. He was an old man who fished alone in a skiff in the Gulf Stream. The old man, what is the old man in the sea? Exactly. Yes! Ernest Hemingway. Novels first line 200. The Salinas Valley is in northern California. I don't know this one. Player two. Player two. What is east of Eden? East of Eden. That's right. Pick again. Let's try tribes. tribes. For 100, please, Alex. 400. 
The Havasupai have been living in a branch of this canyon seen here for over 600 years. I think I know what is what is it without looking at the video. Show you the clue. Yeah, it's the Grand Canyon. Where's the Grand Canyon? Exactly. Yep, Tribes 200. The Blackfeet lived in these structures and decorated them with paintings of real I... and mythical creatures. Caves? What are teepees? Oh, teepees. Yes. Good day, I need to bring in. Give me... Myths, Myths and, and Legends, legends 400. For 100, Alex. When Sir Kay needed a sword, this young man, his foster brother, fetched him the sword in the stone. I don't know this one. Player two? Who was King Arthur? Exactly. I was thinking that, I wasn't so sure. Myths and Legends. Myths and legends for 200. For 200, please. The children of Izanagi and Izanami include the islands of Japan and deities of this religion. What is Shinto? That's correct. Yes. With the legends for 300. This Texas legend was raised by coyotes after falling out of the family wagon. Who's Wild Bill Hickok? Good guess. Ugh. But it's I might have spelled it wrong. We're looking for. Player two? Who was Pecos Bill? Oh, Pecos Bill, okay. Myths and legends. And legends for 400. For 400, please, Alex. This evil Norse trickster god became blood brother I to... I don't know this one. Player three. Who is Loki? Loki. That's right. Pick again. How about TV and TV film? For 400. For 400, please, Alex. This TV radio station featured Dr. I Johnny Fever, Venus Flytrap, and Les Nessman on the air. Player three. What is WKRP in Cincinnati? WKRP in Cincinnati. Okay, nice time, nice time to leave for me. TV for 500, finish it off. Kasana and Tamburlaine the Great was played on Broadway in 1956 by this future starship captain. I don't know this one. Player three. Who is Patrick Stewart? Good guess. No. But it's not what we're looking for. It's not Patrick Stewart. Is that it? Anyone? Take a look. We'll Here's Shatner. Shatner. Let's do festive, festive food, food for 400. For 400, please. Cinco de Mayo is the perfect time to serve margaritas and this classic avocado dip. What is guacamole? Exactly. Yes. Fin festive food 500. Let's finish it off. This Hawaiian island celebrates its famous onions with an annual festival that includes I don't know this a one. recipe contest. Player two, what is Maui? Maui. Well done. Could yes. be a lot of glasses that one. Oh, how could be another one? That was first lines. lines. For 300, 300. It was Wang Lung's marriage day. I don't know this one. Is that it? Anyone? Player, Player three. three. What is the Joy Luck Club? No. No. Bad. Not the Joy Luck Club. Anyone? Player, Player two. two. What is the Good Earth? The Good Earth. Absolutely. Okay. Now he takes the lead. Now it's first line, 400. For 400, Alex. Oh, then a double. Okay, How much is he going to weigh out that 1900 he has? Wager, He's going for 1300 here. Halfway down a by street of one of our New England towns stands a rusty wooden house. I don't know this one. Two? What is the House of Seven Gables? That's right. Nice, House of Seven Gables. Novel now he's going to lead with 3200. Now it's just like 500. It was a bright, cold day in April, and the clocks were striking 13. I don't know this one. Player 3. What is 1984? Oh, 1984, exactly. okay. Let's try tribes. Tribes, for 300. 300, please. Oh, the Chinook religion was based around the annual run of this fish seen here. If you'll just watch this, we'll show you the clue. That's a salmon. Was it salmon? Definitely. Yes. Try 400. Their name from a Sioux term for people of alien speech is shared by the capital of Wyoming. The Cheyenne? Player one. Absolutely. Yes. Pick again. Finish our tries 500. Cherokee history includes the trail of these. I don't know this one. Play it What are tears? Ah, I was thinking that. Well done, yes. Okay, last clue, Myth of Legends 500, finish off the Jeopardy round. In Greek myth, 
This three-headed snake-tailed dog guarded the gates of Hades. What is the service? Oh, oh no, I, sp I spelled it wrong. I can never spell that word right. Player three. What was Cerberus? Cerberus. Yes. That's correct. So the Jody one, player two is in uh, lead with thirty-two hundred. Player three is in second place with twenty-one hundred, and I'm the last with two thousand. I get the, that means I get to pick first. All right, no problem. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for double jeopardy. All right, what are the categories for double jeopardy? Sunny stuff. Money me dearest. On a go. Classic Classical composers. Countries, countries of the world. And finally. Look at our final category. Good, times. good times with good in quotation marks. So you know what that means. Each word, each correct response will have the word good on it, in it. Let's get things underway. Player one. All right. Good times 200, please. This unselfish guy's story is told in Luke chapter 10. Who is the good Samaritan? Absolutely. Yes. Pick again. Good times, 400. This groovy song was a top ten hit for the Beach Boys in 1966. What's good, vibra good vibrations? Right, you are. Nice. Good times, 600. One of her popular books about chimps is titled "In the Shadow of Man." Who's Jane Goodall? Player one. Very good. Yes. Pick again. Good times, 800. It's the geographic cape at the southern tip of Africa. What is the Cape of Good Hope? Absolutely. Now, I'm time for the now. I'm in the lead now. Good times for a thousand. In Spanish, it's adios. What is goodbye? Player one. Yes. I swept through that category. Sunny stuff, 200, please. It describes a fried egg with a yolk on top. What is sunny side up? Player one. Exactly. Yes. Yeah. Sunny stuff, 400. This country's official name, Nihon, means land of the rising sun. What is Japan? Very good. Yes. Again. Sunny stuff, 600. Mithras, Saul, and Ra are examples of these. What are sun gods? Player one. Absolutely. Yes. Pick again. Sunny stuff for 800. Oh, Ooh, they're double. Not too sure about the close. I'm only going to wager 200 here. The Earth's northern and southern lights result in part from the effects of these solar prominences. Player one. What are solar flares? That's right. Yes. Sir, wager more. That's okay. So I still have a thousand, please. Let's finish that off. Galileo determined the sun's rotational rate by watching these dark areas on the sun shift position. What are sunspots? Player one. Exactly. Nice, went through two categories. On the golf for 200. In 1783, two Frenchmen became the first to get a rise out of this hot Montgolfier invention. What is the Bunsen burner? Good answer. Oh, no, sorry. it's not the Bunsen burner. That's wrong. That's oh, what is that? Oh, I know what it is now. It's the hot air balloon. What we were looking for was this. Sorry. Right. On the golf 400. Names of these space vehicles have included Discovery and Challenger. What are space shuttles? Exactly. Yes. On the go, 600. The RR logo on this automaker's radiator plate changed from red to black in 1933 after one of the founders died. What is Rose Voice? You're in fine nice. form, so pick again. Uh, I'm going to go 800. Models of this U.S. motorcycle company have included the Hydroglide, Electroglide, and Superglide. What is Holly Davidson? Exactly. Yes, finish on the golf for a thousand. Eskimos traditionally use Umiaks, as well as these other native open boating vessels. What are kayaks? All right. Yes, swept to three categories. Country of the world for 200. Hundreds of islands make up about 20% of this oh, European this one nation, know. whose capital is Athens. What is Greece? Player one. Exactly. Yes, country of the world for 400. This Middle East country borders Saudi Arabia and, uh-oh, Iraq. What Player is one. Iran? 
Oh, that's oh, no. correct. Okay. Anyone at all? I think I won one at some point. What Kuwait, okay. Cards of the World 600. The Pope lives in this city that's an independent nation. What is Vatican City? Player one. Very good. Yes. Pick again. Cards of the World for 800. This South American country is named after a Genoese explorer who came to America in 1492. Player one. Uh, I'm gonna say, what is Bolivia? Oh, regrettably, no. no. Shoot. Player, Player three. three. What is Colombia? Hey, Colombia, okay. Let's go for classical composers. Classical composers, okay. For 200, please, Alex. His period of work between Eroica and Symphony Number no. 8 is known as his heroic decade. Who's Beethoven? Well done. Yes. yes. Class of composers for 400. A Freemason, this Austrian sprinkled references to masonry in his Masonic I'm not sure about this one. and the Magic Flute. Player two, who was Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart? Oh, it's Mozart thing. for that one, okay. Let's try Mummy, Mummy Dearest. Dearest. Uh, this one should be interesting. 200. 200. It's this actor's portrayal of the mummy that was used on the one. U.S. stamp. Player three, who is Boris Karloff? Boris Karloff. Exactly. Mummy dear. My dear is for 400. For 400, please. The Curse of the Mummy's Tomb is a top seller in this kid's book series. What's Goosebumps? Player one. Exactly. Yeah. Mummy dear is 600. Ancient Egyptians worshipped these small animals, and now their scans are used to study mummies. What are cats? Player one. As CTA, CAT scans. You're correct. Yes. Mama Dearest for 800. Of 3, 9, or 13, the number of tana leaves it takes to bring a mummy back to life in the movies. What is 3? Nice try. I don't know, it's probably 9. Incorrect. It's okay. Nobody? Nobody. Here's what we were looking for. I said nine. I had to probably type the number in. Oh, no, I said, no, I said three. It was nine. Yeah. In 1994, the royal mummy room in this Egyptian city was reopened after 13 years. What is Cairo? You got it. That's yes. the city we were looking for. Let's finish our country's work for a thousand. <laughs> oh, found the yellow daily double. Nice. What do you wager a thousand about this one? Not 10, 000, this North African country with the capital city of Tunis was the site of ancient Carthage. I'm taking a total guess. What is Ethiopia? Good guess. No, it's not. I it's did not know not about that one. I don't know. Looking for. Here's what we were looking Tunisia, for. Tunisia, okay. Kaiser Kubo's 600. When his Madama Butterfly opened at La Scala in 1904, it was greeted with hisses. It's not Vivaldi. Who is Giacomo Puccini? Oh, Puccini. Right you are. Classical composer. Closes 800. For 800, please. For the 1910 season, Sergei Diaghilev commissioned him to score a ballet based on the Firebird. No idea. Player two? Who was Igor Stravinsky? Absolutely. Igor Stravinsky, okay. Again. And the final answer of, final the, answer round. of the round. This Venetian's first works date from the early 18th century no, 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 during his years as violin master at a girl's orphanage. Player two, Player two, who was Antonio Vivaldi. Oh, that's Vivaldi, okay. Let's see how all okay. Are doing after the double I'm going to leave with 10,000. Player two is the second place with 5,400. And player two is the last place with 3,700. Alright, so we're going to go to Final Jeopardy. Well, now it's time for Final Jeopardy. I'll show you the category and give you a few seconds to think about your wager. Okay, what's the category? The Women's Hall of Fame, okay. All right, go ahead. Make your wager. I'm going to wager 801. Oh, wait, it's not my turn to wager first. Player three, could we have your wager, please? Player two, your wager, please. Player one, please make your wager. 801, I'm going to wager. The final Jeopardy answer is as follows. Good luck, everyone. What is it? One of the two Harriets in the Women's ah. Hall of Fame. They That's both why I do, I do know. With slavery. Who is Harriet Tubman? The other one's Harriet Beecher Stowe. All right, let's see how everyone did. Let's see. Who does she say? Player three. Harry Beecher Stowe. Your question. That's right. Yep. And your wager was? So wager, oh, 3,700 going to 7,400? Your question. Harry, that is wrong. That's not right. I'm sorry. And your wager? So wager everything. 
Your question, player one. Very good. Yep. I want you 801, so give me a total of 10,801. And my run's going to continue. Congratulations to our big winner. Player one. So my total for the my nine game winners total will be. Thanks for playing Jeopardy. Come back and see us again real soon. Thank you. Oops, I'm going to add up to my calculator. Sorry about that. Let's get a few out of the way before we start our game. So it's $131,601. Thank you for giving them a 10, folks. Bye for now.